to my channel, Live in the Solution. I'm Mary Trimble and I'm here to give you your weekly reading. And um, I've meditated on these cards. Hold on, some of them are ups. Um, you can use this for your rising sign, oh, your moon sign um, and your sun sign. Two popped out really fast. Oh, three. You're getting very clear messages, Capricorn. Let's see. It's for next week. That is July the 3rd through July the 9th. Oh, wow. They are going crazy. Okay. So, um, first of all, I'd like to thank you for tuning in and watching, and please like this video if you like what you hear, and um, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and um, comment and share. <laughs> I really appreciate that, and uh, without further ado, let's go to the card, shall we? Okay, Capricorn, let's go to the first card. Oh, lovely. The Ten of Pentacles, which is saying that you're in a really good place now. You're in a good place with your family, friends, loved ones. And, um, and you feel sec and you're secure monetarily. And, oh. Okay, so Capricorn, you've had it all. You've lost it all several times, right? And uh, the feeling of this card is that you feel that nobody understands you and you have the weight of the world on your shoulders and you, you worry um, about being able to keep um, this where you're at right now. And um, this, this is five, so it means changes. So hold on, let me just look at this. Oh, okay, so this is, wow, look, three pentacles. So this is like, this, this is, this I think is asking you to change your perspective, um, Capricorn. Change how you feel um, about uh, money and possessions. This is a lovely new beginning or a change in perspective that I'm getting here. For some of you, I think it's a change in perspective. Let's see what we've got up here. Oh, wow, look, the Queen of Wands. Fun times. Um, this is your, let me just see what's under here too. Let's see what's at the bottom. Oh, the King of Cups, look at that. The King of Cups, a really great leader. He's just got it, he's just, sitting there very comfortably, emotionally. Um, what I would say for you, Capricorn, is that, um, look, hold on, let me just see what's going on here. Ah, okay. So, this is saying, right, that you're in this wonderful place right now and you've really got to focus on that, what, what you're in right now, because you need this change of perspective. This could be, this whole um, underlying feeling is what can bring you back down. So, look, it's not, this is, look, you're charismatic, you've got wit, you've got humor, you're really good um, with people and you've got this, a uh, brand new start here and a very good gift um, which is just in the near past which makes me think that you um, have changed your perspective or you're looking at solutions and this is like lots of invitations and you're really having a good time this is fiercely protecting protecting what you have your family and your possessions this is fiercely you're fiercely protecting um, that. And um, here, look, you may have a challenge, right? But you've got leverage. So the thing is, is your wit, your creativity, and your uh, general leadership will get you out of this. You're in, you're, um, listen, this is this is a card where you may have conflict but you you've got some kind of issue coming up but guess what you've got the ability 
to um, to get out of it. And this is victory. Look, your your uh, wand has all those lovely flowers, and so it's spring. You are getting out of this. You've got you've got everything in place. So you don't have to go back to this. You don't have to lose everything. And so if you don't focus on that, look at the light shining on that, see? Um, this is telling me that, you know, you really need to look at your belief system. This is like stop, you change your storyline, um, Capricorn. This won't stand up, stand up. Change your storyline. You're very good at telling stories, Capricorn. Change it because you don't have to go down back here. Look, you've got all these incredible cards. You're a fighter, you've got um, wit and ingenuity, and you are going to, um, so you are going to rise above everything and you are going to win. You have victory here. This is the victory card. And um, the King of Cups, which is the underlying energy to your whole reading, right the king of cups the king of cups right the underlining energy throughout your reading is um charismatic intuitive can be moody at times but is really um creative and intuitive and has all this wisdom and this is what's going to help you and this says um you know be uh kind and compassionate when you come at across this issue that's coming up but um, this is really you know you have the wisdom you have the wit you have the communication you have the um, uh, you have the leverage you'll come through shining um, so this is a great thing don't don't go here darling don't go there you don't have to lose it You've got all this wisdom and fab. Look, don't give up. Things are going to really look up for you. Um, and you can protect what is yours. You don't, you won't lose it. So get out of that worry. Um, things are very good for you. Focus on your cup half full, you know, and really quieten the mind. Go inside. This is intuitive. This is meditative. This this is your underlying uh, energy to this reading. So change your storyline, Capricorn. Okay, Capricorn, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for liking in advance and thank you for subscribing. And if you'd like a personal reading, you may email me at mary at liveinthesolution.com. I'll see you next week. Bye.